came out of the Helsinki's Tourist Information Office. Um, everybody was super friendly. It's one of the Gay Comfort um, training partners as well. Um, so I've got my Helsinki guides ready to go and explore the city. This is Helsinki's Senate Square. It's the main square right in the centre of the city. Uh, it's got some really impressive and important architecture. Behind me you can see um, the cathedral, uh, which is a beautiful building. It's built in the 19th century. And then on this side we have the, uh, the Senate building as well. This side is the university and we have the university um, library just up here. And so it's an amazing square, some fantastic architecture as you can see. I'm down here now by the waterfront, uh, which is uh, one of the places you can get a boat uh, to the island of Saw Melina, which is one of the major tourist attractions in, in Helsinki. Um, you can also get there with a Helsinki card. Uh, I got this from the Tourist Information Centre. It comes in one, two and three days. Um, and it gives you access to all of the uh, public transport and a lot of the attractions and museums as well. It's really nice to be out on the water. There's so much, you see so much water when you're in Helsinki. Um, so it's really nice to be out um, exploring some of the islands which are around. As you can see, there's loads here, just this tiny little island here with a couple of houses on. It's very cute. I'm really loving the, uh, the, the beer with the bear on it. That's quite difficult to say, actually. It's got a couple um, uh, of other beer, beer, not beers, bears. <laughs> which I thought I'd take back for some friends who, uh, who kind of quite like their bears. Here's a couple of the Finnish variety. So just come out of the information centre uh, on the island of Suomen Lina. A really interesting history. Um, this island was fortified by the Swedish to defend against Russia. Um, and it was financed by the French, um, also the English came here and had a bit of a skirmish as well. Um, so it's really interesting history. You can see some of the um, fortifications of the fortress behind, uh, just behind me here. Um, so yeah, it's a really, really interesting place to come and visit in Helsinki. We spent a really nice afternoon on the island of Sormenlina. We had some food and we had a wander around. Um, it was really bright and sunny and there's lots of water everywhere. Um, it's really beautiful, the atmosphere was really good. As you can see, there's lots of other people out enjoying the, uh, the nice fresh air as well. Um, so yeah, it was a really enjoyable afternoon. These are, uh, behind me is the entrance to Helsinki's public baths, which were opened in the 1920s. Um, there's a beautiful pool inside and a sauna and, uh, and sauna relaxation complex. And they have different days for men and women. Um, today is the men's day. Um, so it's really, uh, it's really traditional um, thing for people in Helsinki to do. Um, and it's also very popular. And we can't uh, film inside, um, but we'll show you some shots of what it is like inside. It's very beautiful from the pictures I've seen. And um, we'll tell you what it's like when we come out. I've just come out of the, uh, the public baths and sauna complex. It was a really great experience actually. The, in, the uh, interior was uh, really amazing, really fabulous. Um, 1920s interior. Um, there's uh, two different levels and there's a big 25 metre swimming pool. Um, so lots of people swimming and socialising and chatting and, um, and then also um, in the saunas as well. So five different saunas, um, you know, people making full use of those, the Finnish saunas. Um, so yeah, it was really good. I would thoroughly recommend it if you're in Helsinki to come along to the, to the bars here and the website's just at the bottom of the screen. I'm here outside the Tawny Hotel. Um, there's a beautiful restaurant on the top and a bar. It's got the best view of Helsinki and we're going to go up and have a look now. This is right in the centre of uh, Helsinki, the Esplanade Park. And it's actually the, the second day of spring here. Um, so the sun is shining, so you can see it's a beautiful, um, crisp spring day. Um, and one thing you notice about Helsinki is that when the sun comes out, so do the people. So there's so many people here, they're basking in the sun and really enjoying it. So really nice atmosphere in Helsinki.